Today, Kevin and I are going to be making the Frankfurt Hot Chocolate Bomb and the Pumpkin Spice Hot Chocolate Bomb. These were sent to us from the fine folks at Frankfurt. Uh, they're made with Belgian chocolate and they include many marshmallows. So we actually tried the Hot Chocolate Bomb. We did a review of this last year and it came in a blue box last year. So they've changed the color of the box, but now they've... Uh, uh, added the pumpkin spice as an additional flavor. So we figured we'd try it again, just so that we could compare the uh, flavor of the two. So what you wanna do is get you a big cup and show you what it looks like. It's in nice wrapping and it has fall leaves on it. So there's all kinds of pretty leaves. You hear the marshmallows? So we're gonna put that one in there. And then let's look at the pumpkin spice, see if it has the same package. I didn't pay any attention through the window. Ooh, I like this package. This is, uh, that's such a pretty color. And it has little pumpkins all over it, it's so cute. Okay, so you open it up and it's easy to open. There you go. I'm gonna put that in, in my pumpkin cap so I'll remember that that's the pumpkin. And you want to heat, ooh, and it smells really strong of pumpkin too. Uh, you want to heat eight ounces of milk and then you want to pour it over the top uh, slowly of your bomb. So I'm gonna pour this right over the top. It's getting, it's getting melty in that, uh, that hot milk, and it's gonna have little mini marshmallows. There's your marshmallows. Oh, aren't they cute? Look how cute they are. So you stir. Now we're gonna do our pumpkin spice. So, let's Dive into this one. Up oh, there's some, there's your marshmallows. You can see them under there. So I'm just gonna dunk it in the in the milk. And I know I said it before, but that pumpkin spice uh, smell is it's a strong smell. Sure. Yes. So I'm going to stir this one up just like I did the hot chocolate, and we're gonna take it over to the table and give it a try. So this, like I said in the beginning, this was sent to us free from Frankfurt, both of these, and they sent uh, the press release. Uh, hi there, fall is in the air. As the cooler weather approaches, Frankfurt candy is welcoming in autumn with the launch of its new Frankfurt pumpkin spice hot chocolate bomb. Rolling out nationwide this month, the limited edition Frankfurt pumpkin spice hot chocolate bomb features a pumpkin spice flavored Belgian milk chocolate exterior and vanilla mini marshmallows inside, giving it a sweet and slightly spicy finish. It smells strong. Yes, the Frankfurt pumpkin spice hot chocolate bomb will be available at Target and Rite Aid stores nationwide and online at Amazon, Amazon and Frankfurt Candy Company. Um, I almost said like that like a Brit. Amazon. Uh, Amazon. Amazon. Uh, you can tell what I listen to all the time. Um, the company also is introducing new fall inspired packaging for its original Frankfurt hot chocolate bomb wrapped in gold foil with leaf graphics and packaged in a red box. The fall Frankfurt hot chocolate bomb pays homage to the vibrant colors of the season. The fall Frankfurt hot chocolate bomb will be available at Walmart, Target, Walgreens, and Rite Aid stores nationwide beginning this month. We hope you enjoy these seasonal hot chocolate bombs that are perfect for a fall pick-me-up treat. So, the, the, just the regular hot chocolate bomb is one package, 45 grams, is 230 calories. And that is not including the milk. Your milk, whatever milk you choose to put. And that milk we put in there uh, was boiling. <laughs> it started boiling when we poured it in there. So we allowed it to cool. We're not drinking boiling no. milk. <laughs> That's nice, isn't it? Mm, it's nice. It has a, a good chocolate flavor. Yes, it's it's nice chocolate. It's sweet. It's. Um, a light uh, uh, 
it's a strong chocolate flavor, but it doesn't, um, it's, it doesn't have a lot of depth to it. I mean, it's just a, a nice sweet chocolate that everybody will enjoy. You yeah. know, it's not dark chocolate is what I'm trying to say. It's yeah. just milk chocolate. And the marshmallows didn't add a lot of like a creaminess to it like you get with sometimes. So you may want to put more marshmallows in it, but, uh, but I like it. It's good. Oh, so a lot of adults I think would uh, like dark, darker chocolate. This is not, this is more for me because I like milk chocolate. So this is my kind of thing. Just sweet and chocolate. That's what this is. Mm -hmm. So now this one is the pumpkin spice and go ahead and take a drink. I cannot wait to see. Uh, it's very strong smelling. So this one was, the chocolate was 230 calories. This one is 220 calories. Okay. And I, I don't know if you said, but there's eight ounces of milk. It's eight ounces of hot milk. Um, if you let them sit for a little while, it helps melt it a little bit more um, than when you first put it in there. That's a very strong spice. It's extremely strong, mm -hmm. yes. I think... It's almost too strong. It's too strong, mm -hmm. yes. I, I hate to say that. Oh, I mean, um, if you really, really, really like pumpkin spice, I mean, like, you like it in everything, mm -hmm. then you might like that. But for me, I agree with you. It's, it's almost too strong. I would have to add more milk to that mm -hmm. to make it to where I could enjoy it. It um, and it kills the chocolate flavor almost completely. Yes, all you <laughs> all you taste it's is the spice. pumpkin spice. Um, like I said, if you're gaga over pumpkin spice, you you will love it. But it's it's a little strong for me personally. My suggestion, if you're gonna buy this, because you know it, it is cool, mm -hmm. but it, especially if you're buying it for kids. Add more milk. Yeah, I don't Be, know if a kid would even enjoy that. I don't either. Maybe they would. Okay. It's, it is very, very strong. It's so strong that it will almost burn the back of your throat. That's yeah. how strong the pumpkin spice is. Um, I think if you did it on, if you're if you're going to drink it, uh, maybe if you went to 10 ounces of milk. Okay. And, and lowered the, like diluted it a little bit more. I think that right. might help. Yeah, it needs it needs something because yeah. I think it's I think a lot of people are gonna be like, oh, wow, that is too much pumpkin spice. Yeah. And, like I said though, some people are gonna love it. And so. if you've never had pumpkin spice, I would not don't, give don't start with I that. wouldn't no, <laughs> no, because I think that would be somebody would try that and be like, Oh my gosh, this is so strong, I yeah. never want it again. I mean they definitely so, put the flavor in there. They that did. One. The flavor's in there and I appreciate it greatly. I'm so grateful that they sent it to us and allowed us to try it. And, and I hate to ever say anything negative, but I have to be honest, and I would buy this one over and over again. Yeah, it's I, good. This is perfect. It's great, it's sweet, it's chocolate. This is a lot of fun. I just think that one's too strong. So that one would be a pass for me. Right. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.